Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with a dual case break of 2023 Hip Parade Football Autographed Limited Edition Series 11. Random team break number 220, total boxes in this one. Big thanks to this group for making it happen. Congrats to the people who won spots in those two fillers that we did, Chronicles 14 and 15, those hanger pack breaks. And uh, the, there's all the football teams. Let's roll it, randomize it, one and a two, three times. One, two, and three. After three, we got Dennis down to Heim. One and two, three times for the teams. Two and three. We got Miami down to the Saints. All right, Dennis, you got the Dolphins. Steve with the Steelers, Jason with the Lions, Dennis with the Bears, last spot Mojo. Steve with the Cardinals, Kaim with the uh, Texans, Jason with the Titans, Boyd with the Niners, Scott with the Bills and Cowboys, Dennis with the Jets, John with the Broncos, Joe Cook, Colts and Seahawks, Tristan with the Saints, uh, with Tr Tristan with the Patriots, that is, Scott with the Buccaneers, Michael with the Jaguars, Steve Bircher with the Ravens, Dennis with the Eagles, Scott with the Commanders, Dennis with the Packers, Ed P with the Browns, Steve with the Giants, Ivan with my Raiders, Scott with the Rams, David with the Panthers, Anthony with the Chiefs, John with the Falcons, we got Edward with the Bengals, Tristan with the Chargers, Scott with the Vikings, and Haim with the New Orleans Saints. Is Haim the famous Kaim? Let's sort by team name. We're going to pause the video. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades. Then we'll have the break. Stick around. BRB. All right, ladies and gentlemen, look at this. A deal got done. Jason Parker, Joe Cook making some deals. Wheeling and a dealing. So Jason is out of the Detroit spot. He wants a bird instead. Joe's like, I don't want a bird team. I want a cat team. Joe is out of the bird team and into a cat team. Bird team mojo, cat team mojo, trade mojo. Let's see who draws first blood in the trade. Trade window is closed, TWC. Let's print, let's rip. Got 20 boxes of this nice stuff here. Let's see if we can get some nice hits for as many people as possible. All right, good luck here on a Thursday. The first round of the draft is in the books. NFL draft in the books. A lot of, lot of trades at the top. A lot of teams wheeling and dealing, making some moves. Were there any surprise picks? I suppose we'll have to see what the pundits say tomorrow. I was just watching a little NFL Network on, during the trade window and they were talking about how they were a little surprised at how high Jameer Gibbs, the running back, went. Good player, but that high? I don't know. One of the one of the talking heads thought maybe uh, I don't know maybe the Jets should have gone with something on the offensive side of the ball. They went defense. Maybe offensive side of the ball could have used something, especially with Aaron Rodgers there, a, a offensive lineman, a tight end, a uh, another pass catcher somewhere. We'll see. They can still get that in the second round, though. All right. First one is going to be A.J. Brown for the Fly Eagles. Fly. 26 out of 100 from Obsidian Football. Eagles. Eagles with a... Uh, I feel like they had a nice draft, right? They got Jalen Carter. That was good. That's going to be... Um, it's a good addition to that already strong defense. And then they got Nolan Smith at the back end of the draft as well. So they just shorn up that defense. That defense is going to be good. Of course, they still got A.J. Brown out there. Dennis once again with the Eagles. Next box. We got Aiden Hutchinson, two color, dual relic and autograph. 
54 out of 125. Lions, Joe Cook drawing first blood in the trade. Let's see if we can even it out for, uh, for Jason Parker, who has the Seahawks. Got select football, got tie-dye, got the silver and black, Josh Jacobs. Nine out of 25. My hope is that the Raiders take care of business in the draft, then take care of this guy as well. Raider taking Tyree Wilson, a little uh, defensive end. I like the pick. We got two in here. Got two hits, a two hitter. We got a Stefan Diggs star rookie. Nice, that's from 2015 Upper Deck Football. So in 2015, the checklist would have had him as a Minnesota Viking. That's gonna go to Scott in the Vikings. If in case you're wrong, Scott has the Bills as well, so. All right, the second hit is a one of one. Hail Mary Signatures, Phil Sims. Got the NFL players laundry tag right there, the one of one. The Phil Sims. Giants, Steve Birch with the Giants. Steve, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. I spotted a Phoenix football card. It is Brees Hall, jersey and autograph. He'll have a, a new guy handing it off to him, sometimes throwing it to him. It goes to Dennis and the J-E-T-S Jets, Jets, Jets. Next is Tyree Kill. Three color, big three color patch and autograph. Nine out of 10. Another one from Phoenix. This one's for Dennis and the Dolphins. Yeah, we do need to add some soccer product. I don't know when. We'll get some on there. Maybe it's been a while enough where people are people want to see a little more soccer inside. We can dig some up. Another two card box. This time we got James Harrison all time greats. Ten out of forty nine for the Steelers. That will be for Steve Birch. And the second hit is DK Metcalf for the Seahawks. Sixteen out of twenty five. We'll have a we'll have a new friend in the receiver room. Seahawks with a the wide receiver towards the end of the draft. That's going to be for Jason Parker and the Seahawks. There you go. The other side of that trade. So right now, balanced out. One and one. There's an Aaron Rodgers. Nice. Five out of 60. In, that, in an old upper deck set from 2011. He'd obviously be a Green Bay Packer in that checklist. Silver Ink Auto. That'll be for Dennis. Well, I guess Dennis has the Jets as well. So in case you're wondering if someone got screwed, nobody did. Everyone's fine. 
We go by the checklist first, of course. Nice. All right, next up, it is, it's a dirty bird, it's Desmond Ritter. Three color, dual relic, gold ink autograph, 43 out of 49. There was a little chatter about maybe will the Falcons trade up, will they get a quarterback, this and that. They didn't. I think, think they're going to keep rolling with this guy, so that's good news for John McGee, who has the dirty birds, the ATL. All right, next one. Next one is going to be Jerry Judy, rated rookie autograph for the Denver Broncos. That's going to be for John McGee. That's the 10th box. We got 10 more. Good luck, everybody. Here's another double card box. First one is Garrett Wilson from Impeccable Football. 60 out of 99. Nice. House Jets could be real scary next year. It's going to go to Dennis and the Jets. And here is Zach Wilson, 12 out of 25. I guess maybe he'll learn a thing or two from, from Aaron Rodgers. All the good stuff, though. Not all the weird stuff from Aaron Rodgers. <laughs> all right, so both of those go to Dennis. It's a personal box for you, Dennis. All right, we've got a blue horseshoe. That's Jonathan Taylor. Signature moves. 10 out of 25. Oh, man, that's going to be a real interesting team. I, I, there's, uh, I feel like Anthony Richardson, the new quarterback for the Colts, has such a high ceiling, but also could potentially have such a low floor. I don't know. Is he going to be a week one starter, Anthony Richardson? All right, for my Raiders, there's Derek Carr. 16, uh, six out of 15, just a couple off the jersey number. This will go to two, Ivan and my Raiders. Thanks for your service, Derek Carr. Appreciate you. Hopefully he does well with the Saints, just n never never against my Raiders, though. All right, next is... Is... A rookie ticket autograph, Matthew Stafford. Lions edition. It's going to go to Joe Cook. Nice. I don't know if I'd be ha how happy I'd be if Brady ended up and Gruden ended up with the Raiders. I don't think the Raiders were were a Tom Brady away from the Super Bowl.
Next up is Micah Parsons. 104 out of 199. Rookie autograph for Dallas. That's going to be for Scott and the boys. Oh, Gronk knock. I still don't think that would have made a difference. That defense was way below league average. They had a league average defense, and I might, I might feel differently about that, but they didn't. We got Justin Jefferson from playoff, a uh, playbook football that is twelve out of forty-nine. Vikings, Scott, with Minnesota. Brady can take any team all the way. I don't think so. This is not like uh, it's not like prime LeBron or it's not like basketball or anything like that. I think Brady was very calculated and very smart in making sure that he goes to another good team. Otherwise, Brady would have gone to the Lions and then been like, listen, I can take any team to the Super Bowl. I'll go to the Lions and deliver their first Super Bowl ever. There's Kenneth Walker the third, 112 out of 149. That's for Seattle. That'll be for Jason Parker. Uh, he wanted Vegas, did he? Really? That's, some speculation says that. Some speculation says no. There might be some revisionist history afterwards as well, but... There's a Luminous Endorsements, Jalen Hurts, nice. 29 out of 99. Well, that's what Gronk says, so what has Brady said? There's Dennis with the Eagles. I, you know, you can't really believe it until, although I guess Brady never denied it, but still. That's what I officially want to hear it out of Brady's mouth. But oh, did did Brady said Gronk was correct? I still don't think Brady could have done it. Not not with the Raiders as constructed. Not that year. Here's Juju Smith Schuster. Three color jersey and autograph. Three out of ten. That's for the Steelers. Steve Birch. the 20th box. It's going to be for the Rams. It's Jared Goff, rookie, jersey, and auto. That's for Scott and the Rams. 99 out of 99 from Spectra Football. And there you go, boys and girls. Great uh, hit parade break in the books. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. And I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.